Yo, how's it going you guys? New Age here with another showdown live and this time around I decided to chill in some OU stuff. Um, it's been a lot of fun being up in the other tiers and whatnot. Uh, but <laughs> I think I'll take a break. Not really like an extended one, just like for this for this episode. And then we'll hop back into it in the next one, trying out some other tiers. Trying to figure out what other tiers I like in Pokemon and all that good stuff. Uh, but this time, I have like an old OU team that I made. Um, it was, it's pretty fun. I feel like it's weak to a lot of like setup things. But um, other than that, I enjoy it. It's got like standard Scarf Kyrium, uh, Bulky Defog Scizor, uh, Air Balloon, uh, Stealth Rock Heatran, but like a max speed offensive one. So, it's like, I don't know, it's really fun against like Garchomp and like Landorus leads and stuff. Uh, Mega Metagross with Bullet Punch and Pursuit. I know everyone always says not to run Bullet Punch on Metagross, but <laughs> it's always funny because people don't expect it. Um, Resto Chesto Rodom. That's the thing that I haven't seen in so long. And AV Tornadus. I feel like standard AV Tornadus. Doesn't have Heat Wave, but you know. Whatever, we got a heat trend and other things. So yeah, we'll find a game, we'll be right back. Alright, we got a game against, ew, a Chansey and a Superior and a Mega Low Pony. Oh my gosh, why do we feel like I just get wrecked by this? Uh, let's see. So I don't really need heat trans air balloon for anything, so that's nice. That's always something I look for like right off the bat. Um... And I guess I could just get up my rocks unless he leads with low bunny. Then I just go out into Scizor. I also have Scarf Kyrium, so I mean that will do nice against Superior and Priority and Metagross. And Tornado, so I'm pretty sure is faster and Superior too. So I guess we'll be chilling. Alright, cool. Way to lead with the low bunny. Alright, I'm just gonna go out in Scizor. I'm actually gonna check some some calc things. I want to see how much uh, Kyrim can do to Superior. Let's see. Scarf Kyrim B and Superior. Ice Beam, oh my gosh, does so much. If we get up rocks, it's basically a guaranteed one hit KO. So that's cool. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't see why he's taking so long. I mean, he has regular jump kick. Also, that's horrible that that did so much. Uh, why did that do so much? Oh my gosh. I'm like max HP, max defense. Yeah, so I'm just going to U-turn here. And he is Rocky Helmet. On his Skarmory. But now we can go Heatran, I think, and just kind of kill this thing. Yeah. I mean, we're max. Uh, he might just go out in a Chansey. But if he does, I think I'm just going to use that as an opportunity to get up my rocks. So. Alright, yeah, he does. And we even burned the Chansey, so that's cool. So I'm going to get up my rocks here. And whatever he wants to do. I guess paralyzing me could suck. Yeah, okay. Um, hmm. What do you go out into here? Am I defensive Rotom too? I don't think I am. Yeah, I'm specially defensive Rotom. Uh, I don't want him to T-Wave again though, because I need Tornadoes. So I guess I won't go out into that. Hmm. I guess I'll go Rodom, and then I have to Volt Switch like right after that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have to Volt Switch. In case he goes into like, Superior. Alright, cool, so he decides not to switch out. Which means, I'm probably just gonna go back into Heatran. No, I think he's gonna Soft Boiled here. How much can I do to Chansey? 
What? You forfeited? Hello? Alright. I mean, that's not what I was hoping he would do, but whatever. I guess we'll take it. Alright, we'll find another game. We'll be right back. Alright, we got another game against a rain team. <laughs> oh, that's gonna suck. I think. I'm pretty sure it's gonna suck. Especially because I kind of have nothing for Swamp Root. So it's just gonna lead like Politoed, right? Hmm. I mean, how much could... Nah. I can't just go Fusion Bolt with Kyrim right off the bat because that just gives him the easiest switch in the Swamper of his entire life. Um, I guess we'll lead Rotom. Yeah, so he's going to lead Politoed and I'm just going to go Will-O-Wisp like right away. Because I don't want his Swamper to just come in. I don't really think it would. Because, I mean, we're specially defensive realm, so we could take hits from Politoed. And he actually goes Tentacruel. Okay. So that is a bit better. Um, I mean, not better, but that's what he decided to do. Um, hmm. I still don't really have anything that wants to take a Scald. Yeah, like nothing at all. <laughs> I don't want anything I have to get burned. Grant, I don't really need superpower this game, so I guess. Oh, and now he's gonna go Swamper. Okay. I mean, kind of the same thing still happens. So let's see. Let's see what you got, mate. Yeah, because I don't know what he does here unless he just switches again. This is basically what would have happened last turn. Alright, so he's going to get up rocks. Hmm. And then what? I think I'm going to go for Hydro Pump. He doesn't have anything with like Water Absorb or something. So, I'll get damage off on something. Oh my gosh, he crit me. And flinched me. Okay. Well, you know, that's cool. Yeah, it does so much. That does a lot too, though. Alright, I'm gonna rest right here. And... What do I do against this thing? I might want to will his 2, even though he's probably special. He misses Draco, but we're specially defensive. Oh, okay, we missed 2, so, you know, there you go. It did waste a turn of rain, so that sucks on his part. Um... So what do we do here? I think he's gonna Draco again. Let's see. Kingdra. He's not Life Orb. Is he? Yeah, he's not Life Orb. Against Rodham. Special tank. So Draco Meteor is 66. Dang. Maybe he got like a hella max roll. 27 to 33. So this shouldn't kill me. But do I want to risk that? Because Rodham is putting in a lot of work right now. I'm going to rest. Alright, cool. Um, and I think I'm just going to stay in here. Because he, yeah, he can't do much to me and he's just going to die to burn, so might as well get a sleep turn off here. So we got rid of Swampert without, like, any cost, basically. Which is really nice because Swampert was a threat. Um, I feel like now the only major threat is Kingdra. Everything else, we kind of, is more just bulk. So shouldn't really be able to like power through our team like that. I also don't know what he's going to do here. I mean, I, I don't wake up this turn anyways, but I should be able to take any hit. Yeah. Alright, and I think... Oh, he forfeited. <laughs> Why is everyone forfeiting? 
I mean, honestly, I am pretty sure I could have won that one, especially because I was Scarf, uh... I mean, he might have been Scarf Kingdra, actually. How fast is Kingdra? Oh, well, I outspeed him with Scarf Kyrim, if he was Scarf anyways. 232. Let me see. I want to make sure. Max speed. Or sorry, I'm not max speed, I'm 232. I mean... Yeah, we would still outspeed him. With the choice scarf, so... I guess, yeah, we kind of had that one in the bag. Alright, well, I guess we'll find another game. Alright, we got another one. Also, I want to say, too, I'm not going to, like... I mean, I'll leave these those games in the video, obviously, but... I'm not gonna like count it towards like, oh we've had three games now, let's like call it a live. I'll more so go off of like time or something. Also this team looks horrible and like really annoying to deal with. <sighs> um, okay he left. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's wrong with these people? Alright, we'll find another game. I right, found the game. I think that last person actually could have put in work against us. If he got up Sticky Web, like, I think his pincer could just run through our whole team. You know, potentially. I mean, we did have Defog, but still. I guess with the Defog, it would have been easier to handle. Anyways, so, we got another game. Uh, I'm not too worried about Clef, because I have Kyrim with Iron Head. Also, he has a Lander, so I get to lead Heatran. <laughs> um... I don't think Mega Pinsir or Mega Scizor could sweep me if I keep Heatran healthy. He has he has a lot of potential things that could mess me up on his team, and I just have to make sure I play smart. Um, I think I'm just gonna go out into my own Rodom here. Yeah. Yeah. Because if he burns me, then I still have rest and we're specially defensive so we could take the Volt Switch. So he's going to go out into Latios right here. Uh, let me see. Rodham. Special defensive. My max special defense. 248. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Alright, Latios, Life Orb Attacker. 85 to 100. Okay, so that does indeed kill me. Um, I mean, I have Metagross. Oh, uh, whoops. Latios. Yeah, Draco doesn't do much. HP Fire kind of does. Um... And then who's our other option? Tornadus. I just want to check both of them. Assault Vest. Oh my gosh. Alright, so yeah. We're going to go Metagross here. Because <laughs> that's the only thing that can take a Draco. And we get to Mega Evolve and Pursuit the crap out of this man. It said Pursuit does like 50 some percent. But... Yeah, I was going to say, if it does double on the switch, then that's a dead Latios! <laughs> and potential defog out of the way as well. Um, so he could be Scarf Tyranitar. I feel like he's Mega Titar though. No, wait. Yeah. No, if he was defog Latios, then he would be Mega Scizor, I guess. If he's Scarf Tyranitar though then pretty sure Earthquake just takes us out. Or Crunch, oh my gosh. Or Pursuit. <laughs> I think Pursuit actually can knock us out. Oh, my bad. Metagross. Let's see, what am I at? 136, oh. This is that set. Okay, so Meteor Mash can one-shot him. Earthquake 
actually is not in his favor to knock us out. Crunch can knock us out for sure, but if he goes for Pursuit, that won't. So, if we can get off a of Meteor Mash here. Yep, alright. Hey, that's a dead T-Tar. <laughs> nah. So he actually was Scarf, but was expecting me to switch out, but that wasn't in my best interest, because if I switch out, then it just dies. And I had a chance to live Earthquake, so the only thing that for sure killed me was switching out or if he went for Crunch. So, I I liked how that played out. That was nice. Um, if he both switches again and I go into Rotom, nothing else on his team can really touch me. I can just Volt switch on Clef. Yeah, so he's going to go for Hydro Pump. We're going to be fine with that. I'm going to go for Will-O-Wisp here. We are faster. We're not max speed, so that had to have been a speed tie then. Um, and he left. Oh my gosh. People don't like battling this team, apparently. Hey, but I'm glad it's doing well. We would have, I think we would have lost that first game, but the other ones I think we had. Especially this one after catching the Latios and T-Tar. That went pretty well. But we'll be right back. Find another game. All right, we got one. Um, this is like so hella standard everything. All right, I think once again, we lead Heatran. Um, yeah, I feel like Heatran is fine. He's gotta be like, is he defog and rapid spin? It's more so just to catch the Landorus because we can knock it out. So, Otherwise, I feel like he might lead Starmie to try and counter the Heatran lead, but since we have specially defensive Rotom, we could just go out into that, I guess. Grant, he can make a double, then go into Charizard, but then that just invites Heatran back in. Unless he doubles into, like, Latios, or then doubles into Landorus, that would be a nice play. But we're max speed, max special attack, so I know uh, Starmie takes us out. I mean, if he's utility, let's see. Like with no, no um, special attack investment, Scald can't knock us out. Which I think he, Hydro Pump actually doesn't knock us out either, but that's only if he's utility. So he actually leads with Latios. That's interesting because. We can most definitely take a, uh, a Draco Meteor. Granted, then we have to uh, worry about his Heatran. But I'll go for the rocks here. He goes for Psy Shock. Um, I could... Actually, no. I can go into Metagross. I'm going to do that. Because now we know that Pursuit just knocks him out. So I'm chill with this. Grant he could go star me, which that would suck because I don't think pursuit will knock that out. Let's see. Metagross against star me. If he's utility, yeah, pursuit won't knock it out. Yeah, so he's gonna defog here, and then we're just gonna pursue and get rid of the Latios. <laughs> oh yeah. Hey, all right, one defogger gone. It did cost us our air balloon though, so that's a little unfortunate. Um, he could go by sharp here, and maybe like SD. That'd be pretty scary. He actually goes Charizard. Um, he's not Charizard X, is he? Crap. If he's Charizard X, that's kind of a problem. And he would outspeed us after a Dragon Dance. But I can't just straight up go Rotom. Because Solar Beam will blow us back. Let's see.
252. Solar beam 69 to 81. Oh my gosh, that does so much. Uh, I don't want to go Tornadus either, but I guess I kind of have to. I feel like that's the only thing I could go into. I feel like it's still... Oh my gosh, Fire Blast does so much. I'm going to go tor Tornadus just to figure out which Charizard he is, I guess. I don't think that's my best play, though. Oh my gosh, he is a Charizard Y. Or X. Crap. Alright, I think we lose then. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's horrible. And actually, that was a good play on his part, because if I stayed in and went for EQ, then he's just chilling. Oh my gosh. Alright, confuse him. It's my only hope. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, and our air balloon is gone. Hmm. We don't even have a dragon move on Kyrim. Earth power is not knocking this thing out. And I'm pretty sure it outspeeds us. Oh my gosh. Oh, we actually outsped him. I mean, we're dead still, but... Uh, I don't know what to do here. Let's see. <laughs> Charizard X. Dragon Dance. Let's see. Am I... I'm max HP, max attacks is where I know. No, max HP, max defense. Oh my gosh. <laughs> there's, there's no hope! Alright, so... Bullet Punch does... 8 to 10. That'll put him at 20. And then Metagross... Does 13 to 16. So... We... Will still lose. Unless, I don't think Ronim can take a hit. Ronim wash. What the? There's a specially defensive one. Uh, Ronim actually could take a hit. Maybe I'll just go Ronim and like... Try and Hydro Pump. Oh, wait, this is now plus one. Ha! <laughs> Ronum could still actually take a hit. I'm actually gonna go Scizor, though, because if he has to Flare Blitz, then that puts us in a position where he will die. Although I feel like he could switch here and still win. Not if I get a Brox, though. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so, I guess I should have done this first, well, nah, it didn't matter. Alright, let's see. Oh, crap, he has roost. Alright, it's over. <laughs> I mean, he would have to, uh, flare blitz me, wouldn't he? I'm gonna U-turn. Oh my gosh. Alright. Do I Hydro Pump? Or do I Harden the Scizor? <laughs> Let's see. Scizor. Oh, you Defog. Uh, we eat up a Dragon Claw pretty well, actually. Yeah, I'm just gonna go Harden the Scizor. Oh my gosh. Alright, it's GG. <laughs> Alright, so there you go. We finally lose one to Mega Charizard X. Hmm. I guess this team is pretty weak to it. Maybe I could get rid of Fusion Bolt on Kyrium and put like Outrage. 
I guess. Yeah, let's try that. Because I feel like between like Rodham and maybe Tornadus, I guess, uh, we can beat uh, water types pretty well. Let's see. How much does Kyrim do? Am I max attack? I am. Damn. Yeah, so... Outrage definitely one-shots Charizard. Alright, for sure. Well, let's give that a shot then. So maybe we're not as weak to Charizard. We'll find another game. We'll be right back. Alright, we got one. This is a cool and weird and scary team. Oh, he knows right away. He's ready. Should we leave? <laughs> and that's not a good idea, is it? I was gonna say, should we lead Rodham because we have a Chesto Berry? How funny would that be? He couldn't even put us to sleep. But he definitely outspeeds us and can probably blow us back. I mean, he's got to lead Breloom, right? Like, that's that's just the lead right there. Hmm. So what do I do? I guess I would let Scizor get put to sleep. Yeah. He leads Garchomp, hello? Alright, we're gonna go Heatran then. Because he can't Fire Blast, he can't EQ. I hope he tries to Fire Blast you. Um... I guess I'm just gonna get a Myrox for now. Yeah, I didn't really want to do that, but I'm pretty sure we're faster than him too, so. Hmm. He has to Dragon Tail again, right? I'm going to Hurricane. Okay. So yeah, like I said, he has to Dragon Tail again, so. I think I'm just gonna Defog for right now. All right, cool. So he's gonna double. Um, don't really know who to go into here. I think I have to go rot him just because I don't want I don't want to risk him paralyzing me. So he goes for reflect. Um, oh, he's getting ready to set up. I'm gonna will o wisp, and then volt switch, I guess. Alright, so he has spikes, so I, his last move can't be T-Wave, and we crit him, which is cool. Um, we're gonna go Heatran, and then get up our rocks. Sorry, I just wanted to get to that point real quick. And... Oh, we actually can't knock him out because of the light screen. How much do I need Heatran now, though? Heatran is good for Scizor. Because otherwise, I don't really have anything for Scissor. Should I Earth Power? Oh, I mean Hidden Power? I think I will. I'm going to assume he's just going to Dragon Tail again. Oh, he actually goes for Stealth Rock. Okay. Um, hmm. So we are faster. I think here, I'm just going to go Rotom, though. He actually doubles into For Alligator. Um... We're going to will us for sure. <laughs> so he switched into that, trying to catch my HPIs instead of going for like EQ. Which, I guess is a fine play. Oh, he's probably Lumberry. Alright, well, or not. Okay. Then we are going to Volt Switch on you. The screens are a little annoying, but... We will still have speed him with Kyrium. I don't think we can knock him out though through the screens. I think I might just try and go Scizor. Because we're like pretty defensive. And I think I will try and get rid of these hazards again. It's going to get a little annoying. Pretty fast. Oh my gosh. And we do not eat that. Uh, Do we bullet punch here? What do you go for? Waterfall? Blow Punch, knock him out. Frog Gator. Scizor. Uh, 
Uh, bullet punch, 8 to 10%, so that's not knocking him out. I guess we have to go rot him here, right? Maybe I'll try an aqua jet. Oh my gosh. We do not eat that. Man. I kind of have to rest here. Ah, yeah. Alright, cool. Unfortunately, now his Breloom can come in and put something to sleep, which I didn't really want to deal with that, but... So that's a little annoying. But we got Feraligator out of the way, and Garchomp is weak, and Klefki is burned, so we're looking... We're looking pretty chill here. Um, I'm gonna go will for sure. He's probably... Yeah, he's just gonna try and get up rocks. But we burned the Garchomp now, and... I'm gonna go for a Hydro Pup. Wow, that's cool. Um, hmm. I don't think I can kill this with anything. I think we can win this one for sure, though. Uh, earthquake. Nope. Meteor Mash actually can knock him out. Hmm. I guess I'll do that, because then I can at least hit Breloom. Metagross doesn't really do anything else. Can we get an attack raise? Nope. Okay. So, I'm cool with this position, because Klefki can't really come in. Um, Sharpedo is pro. I mean, I guess Scizor could come in too. But if he goes Breloom, I'm just going to bullet punch it. And break a Sash. Alright, so he's going to go Scizor here. Um... I feel like I have to go Heatran or something. I don't want him to catch it with a superpower though. That would really suck. I mean, we'll speed him. Yeah, I feel like we can afford to go Rodom. I think he's. I'm gonna go Rodom. Because even if he's like Lumberry. Or like Swords Dance or something. And hopefully he outspeeds us here. Okay, he's just gonna switch. Cool. Alright, so. There's no way his last move is. Uh, damn it. I have to go Scissor. And. He's faster though. I really wanna defog. I feel like he's gonna just get up another hazard though. He's probably not max speed. I'm gonna bullet punch. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna defog here. He can SD, yeah, but. Oh my gosh, he has knockoff. Huh. Oh, so he'd be SD knockoff, bullet punch, and maybe bug bite? I'm gonna roost here though. And then U turn. Yeah, he is faster, so that's good. So we're gonna go Heatran, and we will outspeed this. He won't be able to take us out with a bullet punch for sure. And this thing will just die. Okay. <laughs> he probably expected me to be um, like a bulky Heatran and could outspeed me, but nah. Not the case. I'm still worried about his Breloom. Uh, Sharpedo is a little scary, especially because we just got rid of our move to hit Water Pokemon with. Um... I think I'm gonna go for rocks because I feel like he's just gonna protect anyways. Yeah. And I don't know, how much does the speed really matter on this thing? Cause I feel like Rodham can still wall it pretty well. Yeah, I'm just gonna lava plume. If he wants to take us out, that's fine. We got our rocks up for Breloom, and that's all I really care about. And I guess he's gotta be Mega Sharpedo, right? And he actually well it's beat us now. Mm. 
Damn. I mean, I feel like I could just U-turn on this thing. And get off some decent damage. And then maybe bullet punch it with Metagross. Sharpedo! Bullet punch is 20 to 24. That's not even bad. Alright, so let's see. It's gonna waterfall and flinch us. Cool. Alright, well now I have to roost. Wow. Oh my gosh. That actually took us out. Uh, that's a little scary now. Now I feel like we could lose to this. Let's see. Oh my gosh. 64 to 75. It's a roll to take me out with Crunch. A roll that is in my favor for sure. Mmm. Oh. Sorry about my phone. I didn't hear it. Uh. I guess let's go rot him. And hope we don't die. Oh my gosh. Really? Yeah, like, I have that couch right in everything. It does 64 to 75%. Damn it. Alright. Um. I mean, I'm just gonna have to outrage that. Outrage will take this thing out. And there's no way he can one-shot me. If he wants to switch, I mean, his Klefki goes down to rocks anyways. And I can always get another switch. Oh my gosh, that did so much. Alright. So this thing is gone, so that's cool. If he goes ahead and Klefki, it dies. Breloom Sash is broken. I think I can still beat Breloom. Like with Tornadus. Uh, hopefully. Alright, so he can mock Punch here, which I guess will knock me out. Yeah. And he's the life orb. Yeah. Alright, shouldn't be able to outspeed us, so I'm gonna check real quick. Um I think I kinda misplayed a bit at the end. But let's see. Tornadus Assault Vest. Mock punch twenty-six to thirty-one. Alright, so yeah, we can live that for sure. Hurricane will knock him out, but I prefer to go for something that will for sure hit. Uh, Meteor Mash can knock him out too. We will outspeed him. We do outspeed him, right? Yeah. Alright, well... Come on, Metagross, you got this, boy. Go get him! Ah! <laughs> Alright, cool. We didn't miss. And that's a wrap. GG. Not bad. Alright, fine. Just leave. <laughs> huh. That was a close one. Dang. Weak to Mega Sharpedo, too? I mean, I guess not if Kyrium's healthy and can just one-shot him. So that's kind of cool. But... Yeah, I guess I kind of sacked more than I needed to then. I like, I need to start looking more into uh, like all of my options of what I could switch into. Because that happens to me a lot where if something's sweeping me, I have a Pokemon that could like revenge kill it and live a hit and all that. But I always seem to sack like so many other mons first. But anyways, anyways, uh, we'll find another game. We'll be right back. Alright, we got another game against a Charizard, again, and a Chansey, which I do kind of struggle with Chansey, to be honest. Unless it's Toxic Chansey, then we chillin'. He's also got a Gengar, which I don't think I normally struggle with. I can knock it out with Knock Off, and then like if Rocks are up, we're chillin'. Uh, Zoomerill, hopefully won't be a problem. It could be. 
I hope it's not Charizard X. I feel like it is. <laughs> what is his lead here? Does he lead with Donphan? I really don't know. I'm gonna save Heatran though, in case he is Charizard X. I <laughs> wanna keep that air balloon. <laughs> I think I could lead Rodham here, unless he leads like Gengar or something. He's gonna lead Chansey, okay. Um, I guess we can find out if he's Toxic or T-Wave. Or Stealth Rocks. That's right, that is a thing he could do. Um, I think I'm just gonna Volt Switch here. If he goes Don Fan, like, I don't even see why he would. Um, but I can Defog and hope that he's not T Wave. Alright, he's definitely T Wave. <laughs> but I'm gonna Defog here. Um, I guess. That's my best bet. Yeah. Because otherwise I think he would have gone for Toxic right there over Seismic Toss. So he's for sure T-Wave. Oh! You cheeky little something. Alright. I'm going to go back into Rodham. Oh, he's gonna soft boil. Alright, so he doesn't have T Wave actually. Counter Seismic Tile, soft boiled, yada yada, all that good stuff. Um, if that's the case, then I'm gonna go Tornadoes here actually. Not trying to double and catch anything, but I get to knock off something, so that's cool. I guess I actually could have gone, uh, I mean, he could counter me, but oh my gosh, that did so much. Um, and now I'm just gonna switch back into Scissor. Which, I do feel like he's going to switch again right here. Like, now would be a good time for him to switch. But he's just going to soft well, Okay. Um, I think I'm going to defog again. I don't know why he's staying in so much. Yeah, he's going to go Charizard here. Um, hmm. Scizor, I guess, kind of puts in the work. Not really. This chance he could kill me anytime with soft boiled. Or with soft boiled. <laughs> with counter. Um. Alright, so what do I do here? He's either gonna Dragon Dance or Fire Blast. He can't Earthquake. So I guess Heatran is my best bet. So yeah, I'm gonna go Heatran. Regardless of which Charizard he is. Okay, he's Y. I'm cool with this. Oh! Predicted. Um, I'm okay with that though. I feel like I handle Charizard Y a lot better than X. Can Kyrium take him out? That sucks though that I don't get up rocks because that would have helped with Gengar. Actually, that would have helped with a lot of things. Um, good play on his part. Let's see. Charizard E. Outrage pretty much kills him. It does 99 to 117, so I would hope. You know what does one shot him though? Fusion Bolt. <laughs> and he could kind of revenge kill me with uh, a Zoom Rail. Or you could just go out into that now, and then I just get to switch, so... I'm chilling. Okay. I guess that works too. Actually, not really, because... Now he dies. I mean, he can go Azumarill here. That's that's the play. Alright, and now we switch, and we go... I don't know. Don't really want to go Scissor. I guess Metagross can be an option. Let's see. Plus six. Aqua Jet. Oh my gosh, does so much. But... We... Have a chance to 2-8 KO him. Actually, no, we will. Or no, we won't. <laughs> We have a chance to 2-8 KO him with Metagross. 
or do we go into Rotom? I mean, getting off the Mega Evolution would be cool. Special Tank. Whew! That's a lot of damage. Hello? How much does Volt Switch do? So we could always Volt Switch. We will be faster yet. Alright, let's go around him. Oh, okay. That works too. Um, I feel like Hydro Pump is my best bet. Yeah, he's gonna go Chansey, but you know, whatever. And then he gets to get up rocks. We did knock off his Eviolite, so kind of interested to see how much we could do with Tornadus. Superpower, but without the Eviolite. Okay, that doesn't do enough stuff. <laughs> I mean, it could do up to 60 too. I'm gonna burn him with Will-O-Wisp and then Volt Switch. Let's see what happens. If he goes for Soft Boil, that's bad. Well, kinda. Let's see. I think he's gonna Soft Boiled here. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna hurricane. Confuse him! Crit him! That works too! Oh, hit yourself! Oh! Yo! <laughs> this dude dies to superpower. Oh! I'll take it. <laughs> Alright, um, this thing definitely outspeeds us if he's scarfed. I kind of don't know who to go into though. He's got to go for Ice Beam or Dragon Move, I guess. Uh, I really don't want to let Scizor die right here. Pretty sure I can't take him out with a Bullet Punch. Let's see, actually. Like, if he is Scarfed. 43 to 52. Uh, that's a pretty high roll. And let's see against Scizor. Because now we know we can knock out Chansey with a superpower, so that is something to keep in mind. Uh, we kind of eat up all of Karim's hits. This one doesn't have Earth Power. Earth Power. Yeah, we kind of eat up all of Karim's hits with Scizor, so I'm down. Unless he doubles. Oh! Alright, I think I'm going to roost here because I really want to keep this thing healthy. Granted, now he kind of just gets a kill. I mean, not really. I mean, yeah, kind of. <laughs> I kind of want a U-turn. Or defog, actually. Like, he's got to go solar beam, right? Nope. Okay. Well, that's cool. Um... I think we might lose this one. But I'm going Kyrim again. Alright, what do I go what do I go for here? I mean if I Yeah, I lose nothing by going for outrage. Yeah, alright, chance he's dead. Oh wait. I kinda lose Kyrim by going for outrage. Because he's going to play rough or belly drum and Kyrim dies. So that's a little unfortunate. That's super, really duper unfortunate. Um, I'm going to go Metagross just because I kind of need to get my Mega Evolution off. And I'm going to Meteor Mash. Huh. <laughs> Damn, that does a lot. Hello? I'm just going to Bullet Punch. I mean, this all this really does is let me get off damage on, or let me outspeed Charizard, but still pretty bad. Also, why is he doing this? Like, I could outspeed him, but I don't, but he doesn't know that. Well, I mean, it could be a speed tie. 
Gengar. I'm gonna assume you're like. Alright. I'm gonna assume you're that set, but not Life Orb. Shadow Ball, 72 to 85. Ow. That hurts. Bullet Punch, 52 to 61. Whew. That's damage. I mean, we could go Tornadoes too. Ugh, I guess I'll go Tornadoes. Yeah, I'm gonna be way too low. Oh my gosh. Um, I for sure outspeed him, so I'm just gonna knock off here. Granted, we, eh, yeah, no, we lose. Because we can't beat Charizard. Yeah, I'm just gonna bullet punch. Like, if he wants to switch out, it doesn't really matter. Because if he wants to bring something in to take a bullet punch, then that works better for me. Alright, um... So he's gonna go Dawn Fan here. I don't really know why. I guess he could knock off? No? Okay. Um... I... Still have my chest up here. Oh, I do. I mean, I don't see why I can't Hydro Pump, but I also kind of want to Bolt Switch. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You're a cool guy. And now he's going to switch. I had a feeling he would stay in and go for knockoff. Yeah, and now he's going to switch into Kyrim, of course. Huh. Le. Sai. Can Metagross live? In an Earth Power. I actually have a chance to. But, I don't know. I for sure can't beat Charizard now. Ah! Okay, well. That works too. Yeah, like this is definitely a losing a losing game here, but Meteor Masher! Damn that did a lot. Alright, and now I lose. Get out of there! Volt switch! Miss solar beam! GG. Yeah, we put up a good fight. Not bad though. Not bad. Yeah, so I like the team. That was a lot of fun. I mean, like, it's cool because I made this team on my own. And it was, like, a lot of trial and error to work some things out. And there's definitely still plenty of things to work out. But I always have fun when I use it. Which is nice. Some of my favorite mons on there, too. I love Mega Metagross. It's amazing. Um, but, yeah. I'm probably going to end it off there. So, if you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. Share the video. All that good stuff. Comment down below what you thought. And I have no idea what tier I'll be in next time. But it'll be something different. We'll try out some more things. But until then. I'm New Edge Steel. Keep on watching. I'll see you guys next time. Later.